All right, guys, it's Real T Dog back here with another video. Over here with Steve. This is actually recorded right after uh, we did the front end conversion. At first, we weren't gonna do this, but then we were like, nah, we got the supplies, why not? So now we're gonna try our hand in polishing these headlights. They're, uh, they're okay. I actually did attempt to uh, polish them not too long ago, but I mean, I didn't have the patience for it, so I kind of just did a half-assed job. So today, we're gonna whole ass it. We're gonna turn these headlights from this. To this. All right, so. There's many ways to sand headlights. A lot of, there's a lot of debate on the right way to do it and all that stuff, but how we're doing it. We're wet sanding it at first with 320 grit sandpaper. I'm gonna do that for a while, then move up to 800 grit, do that for a while, then move up to 2000 grit, and then finish it all off with a 3000 grit. I'm gonna do all of that. Clean it off with some uh, alcohol, 90% isopropyl alcohol. And then I, brought, I bought some clear coat. We're gonna do that after that. And after that clear coat settles in, we're gonna use some compound and polish to uh, shine them up. Here we go. Here's a, uh, hopefully we don't mess something up. <laughs> dollars a pop those might not even be authentic you know what i mean i mean on social media she would like do on her ig stories like you know a bunch of like videos of her or like jars uh -huh. on her bathroom floor next to the bathtub it's just so like okay at first i laughed then i was kind of down about it because i was like well that's so sad that you know people are out there like this but then i got mad because i'm like this bitch killing this bitch killing on her bath water <laughs> all over here struggling I'm like, I'm mad about it, but at the same time, I'm like, is there a way I could meet her so I can marry her? <laughs> 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 One eternity later. All right, so after like what? It felt like an hour. More. More than an hour of sanding. We're pretty tired because of this. <laughs> But after an hour of sanding, we're now taping off and getting some trash bags to uh, cover some of the car because we are going to spray clear coat on it and that stuff is potent. We're going to be using this stuff. This is some of the best stuff you could get in a can. Just short of professional stuff. We use it to re-clear the hard top. Yeah, he used to have the hard top on his S2000. And we use it to re-clear the hard top and it turned out great. So we're gonna use that to clear after we wipe down the headlights with isopropyl alcohol. Gonna wipe it down with that, use the clear, let it settle for a while, then we're gonna use some polish to shine it up. We're also gonna use dust masks while using this clear. And I suggest y'all do too, cause this stuff is pretty toxic. So yeah, let's, uh, let's get to it. Ah, yeah. Here we go. Hopefully, I don't f up. <laughs> Oop. Oh, f up. Let's make sure it's. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, f Smell it already. Oh, yeah. Okay, I guess here goes nothing. I've only done this a few times and I always doubt myself.
you should wait like five or ten minutes between each coat. And we're about to, we're probably gonna do like three coats. So <laughs> use as much as you can. Yeah. This can is no good after a day. Yes, it's true. Once you crack open one of these cans, it has a shelf life of like 48 hours, I think. So use it as much as you can. Definitely coming to it's a little bit of haze, but it's coming together. I actually lost all this hazing, but that's like the inside stuff. Yeah, this headlight has a hazing on the inside, which is weird, but it's okay. Well, me and Steve kind of like talked about a future plan of ours to fix all of that, but that's that's for a future topic. But now it's time for coat number two, I think, right? It's been like about five minutes. Probably more, but you know, whatever. Ooh. Uh, yeah. So we're already done with half a can. I only bought one too, so. <laughs> all right. Definitely looking a lot clearer. Damn. It's not 100% perfect, but several times better than when it was. Sweet. Now we're just gonna throw on this bumper, call it good. We got some places to go tonight. And tomorrow morning-ish, I'm gonna go ahead and polish them. Or maybe tomorrow afternoon. I think you have to wait like 24 hours, but yeah. So hold up for that. And there we have it, folks. It's like a brand new car. Kinda. <laughs> Oof, a spec lip, the Honda badge. Ugh. Ugh. You think it was difficult, Steve? It probably wasn't. No. There was just some tedious stuff, but that was about it. Yeah, we finished technically a, a while back, but we just had to do the headlights. Yeah, when you guys see the uh, headlight clean, like restoring video. We're doing that the same day that we did the front end swap. They're just two different videos, obviously. That part took longer than the actual swap itself because that <laughs> was really, really tedious. A lot of like, you know, patience you needed. So that's about it for this video, I guess. So thanks for watching. You know, like this video, share it if you want. Please subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And uh, I'll, we'll catch you on the next one. Peace.